Question seven: Which of the following is a factor of the polynomial x squared minus x minus twenty? And if we take a look at the answer choices, we have five choices right here. And without knowing like how to do factoring properly,、uh, this answer choice wouldn't help. So let me talk about like, how to you how do you break this down? How do you factor this? X squared minus x minus twenty. So whenever we are talking about factoring, okay, factor factorings, the key is that I want to break this into two parentheses. Two things multiply that will give me a complete x squared minus x minus twenty. And the procedure to do this is the following: look at x squared first, and then ask yourself what times what will be x squared. Well, x times x will produce x squared. So let me put x and x right there. And then we are going to use this negative twenty. We are going to think about two numbers that they multiply to be、uh, equal to negative twenty. So,、uh, so two numbers. Let me just give you guys this. So two number when they multiply, they become negative twenty. And then when you add these two numbers, they have to be negative one. And then we have to just go through the possibilities. And this is called the factor by、uh, trial and error, by the way. So I will just factor by、uh, guess and check, trial and error, guess and check. It works pretty well when you have x squared. Um, when you have、uh, just like one x squared, okay. So、um, notice that if you have negative five times four, negative five times four does give us negative twenty, and then negative five plus four, that will be negative one. So that's pretty much it. I'm going to put. It doesn't matter the order. I can put negative five right here, and then positive four right here. Or I can put negative five right here and positive four right there. Doesn't matter. So this is how you factor it. That's pretty much it. So let me take a look of the answer choices.、Uh, which one do they have? One of the factors is neg.、Um, one of the factors of x squared minus x minus twenty is x minus five, and that's exactly choice A. And that's exactly choice A.